All right, everybody. So I've had some people online whining about this tank. It's just a 10 gallon tank. It's empty. I'm just playing with some ideas right now with a dry tank because I have it laying around. This tank had a leak. It's a cheap tank. It costs 20 bucks anywhere. Yeah, no shit. I know that. Everyone is saying because I had to cut the frame and fix a little leak which I did fine, and I've already water tested, and it's all fine. I've checked all of it, and I'm going to reattach the frame there. That's just holding it on while I'm working on things. But do you do you people really get a cheap tank, and, oh, it had a little leak, throw the entire thing in the garbage, and buy a new one? That cost me, I don't know, hell. Tube of aquarium grade silicone. It cost me ten dollars. See how much is still in there? I've used it on that tank, the turtle tank. I haven't used it on here yet, but I was going to. It, it cost me what thirty cents worth of silicone to fix that. And you're like, nope, throw it away. Buy a new twenty gallon tank. There's a high chance of it leaking again. If I didn't know what I was doing, yeah, sure, it'd probably fucking leak. Putting silicone hard, that, that's not hard. If you can't put a little silicone in a hole and make sure the gap is filled, I mean, you got bigger problems in life. Why would I spend $20 on a 30 cent fix? That's just stupid. Either those people are rich or they're just stupid and broke. I'm like, <laughs> if, if this makes sense to anyone, to throw away a perfectly good tank, which even if I need to take the whole thing completely apart, scrape all the silicone, take the four pieces of glass, or five pieces of glass all the way apart, and rebuild the whole thing, it would still only cost me about five dollars. Why the hell would I go buy a new one? That makes zero sense. At all. And the stupidity of people shocks me. Like, I get it, it's a cheap tank. So I should throw it away and go buy one the exact same size by a higher end company that uses glass, just like that's made of, and silicone, just like that has, but it's rimless. It doesn't have the cheap plastic around the edge. So, it's a $100 tank. Why would I spend $100 when I could buy a $20 tank, take it apart, build it into a rimless tank myself for an extra five bucks. Because it's more convenient to buy one pre-built? Well, that just means you're lazy. I mean, just put in a little work. It's not hard. Don't be stupid. Anyhow, I'm going to uh, continue playing with this. We're not going with this substrate. By the way, you can't tell, but um, that was actually angled, so there's very little in front. But it's weird the camera makes it look like it's that high. Um, I'm replacing that though. I don't I don't like the gravel. We're gonna go with black substrate. Uh, and then the ugly tank with all the plants, which are growing quite well by the way. Um, I'm gonna transplant all those into that tank. And I don't know what the hell I'm doing with that. And I still got a bunch of yard sale stuff. And it didn't sell. All right. That's all I got. Just need to bitch and moan about stupid people on the internet. If I did that every time, I'd be making videos every five minutes. But, alright guys, see you next time.